<laughs> nice conditions. The boat went as fast as it should be. And we worked good as a team, so it was nice. Yeah. Second boat to finish. Only what, 10 minutes behind the TP52? Like, or, or uh, what do you call it? Uh, downgraded TP52, but, <laughs> but still. Uh, we were struggling with the big boats, and we always do. This is this is a little rocket ship in, in light winds. Not so much in upwind heavy weather, but uh, still. The start was the same as the further start, uh, and then the other course was the same as what we call the two star here in uh, in Norway, so which is races we've both sailed before. I think I sailed the further since I was 14 every year or something like that. So we, we've tried this area before. So uh, I guess it was a uh, Small advantage with a uh, small home advantage with uh, all the little uh, secrets, but uh, no race are, are it's the same, so it's always something new. And uh, the weather we had out there t today and last night is uh, I don't ever, I don't think I've seen that before. And uh, with the two weather systems that close to each other, so it was uh, pretty cool. I think yeah, when it's all calm and nice, uh, it's uh, you, you get enough sleep. But when it's uh, <laughs> really windy and you actually need to be two on deck, it's uh, quite a bit more difficult. For, so for the last, I guess, 24 hours, it wasn't that much. But uh, the first day, we slept quite a bit. So I think that the sleeping part we have worked a lot with this year. So I think that has been yeah, one, of, one part of the success. We try to not go to bed and, uh, and take off all the clothes and go to bed for six hours. But you get some, some minutes, maybe up to an hour. That's been very helpful. I think it's it's maybe a bit difficult to take in, but uh, during this weekend, I think it will be <laughs> much. Um, the feeling will get into it.